Good day everyone, here's our math challenge for today. And here's our challenging question. If x raised to x equals 2, then what is the value of this crazy expression x raised to x raised to x plus 1 plus x raised to x raised to 1 plus x raised to x plus 1, wherein x is strictly greater than 0. You can pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. Now, let's answer this question together. I hope you pause this video. So you can try this question first. Now, take note that the given equation to us is just x raised to x equals 2. And we want to evaluate this expression. So, what we're going to do here is to get first the first term, x raised to x raised to x plus 1, and simplify this until we reach the point that we have x raised to x because we know the value of x raised to x. This is just 2. Now, to answer this question, we only need two laws of exponent. Here's the first one. If we have b raised to n plus m, this is equivalent to b raised to n times b raised to the power of m. Now, let's focus on this expression x raised to x plus 1. Now, we can use this identity. This is equivalent to x raised to x times x raised to 1. Now, take note that x raised to 1 is just x. Now, let's rearrange some terms a little bit. Now, here's the second law of exponent that will answer this kind of question. The second is if we have b raised to n times m, it is equivalent to b raised to n raised to the power of m. Therefore, this x raised to x times x raised to x is equivalent or can be written as x raised to x raised to the power of x raised to x. Now, let's stop at this point because we now know the value of this expression because we know that x raised to x is just 2. Now, let's set aside this result and let's get the second expression. We have x raised to x raised to 1 plus x raised to x plus 1. Now, let's have this term x raised to x plus 1. Using the first identity, this can be written as x raised to x times x to the 1. Now, x raised to 1 is just x. Now, let's rearrange some terms a little bit. And then, let's focus on this term x raised to 1 plus x times x raised to x. Again, let's use the first identity. And this will give us x raised to 1 times x raised to x times x raised to x. Now, take note that we just use the first identity here. So don't be confused, all right? Now again, take note that x raised to 1 is just x. Now at this point, let's focus on this expression x raised to x times x raised to the power of x. At this point, we need to use the second identity that we have. So this is equivalent to x raised to x raised to the power of x raised to x. Now, Let's focus on the big expression, or the whole expression, which is equivalent to x raised to x times x raised to x raised to x raised to x. Now, using the second identity, this expression can be written as x raised to 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 x. Now, x raised to x is just 2, we know that. So, at this point, we are now ready to evaluate this expression because this expression, this original expression, is equivalent to x raised to x raised to x plus x raised to 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 x. And now take note that x raised to x is just 2. So this x raised to x is just 2. So we have 2 raised to 2. And on the other side, we have 2 raised to 2 raised to the power of 2. Okay, now let's simplify. 
So 2 squared is just 4. Now, 2 raised to 2 raised to 2 is just 2 raised to the power of 2 raised to 2. So we have 2 raised to 2 will give us 4. And now we have 2 raised to 4 will give us 16. Therefore, the value of this expression is just 4 plus 16 or simply 20. Therefore, the value of this crazy expression is just 20. And as always, we are done.